I'm Morris Trombley. I grew up in the small town of Marsland, which is about 60 miles north of Saskatoon. I graduated from the University of Saskatchewan in civil engineering in 1972. I'm presently a technical director with AMEC Americas. My father was a general contractor, so when I was young, I was involved with building. That's probably what led me to engineering to begin with. My name is Graham Stewart. I'm originally from Glasland, Saskatchewan. I'm in the College of Engineering at the University of Saskatchewan. I think for me, the farm was where it all started in terms of my desire to go into engineering as I was always looking at the machinery and, and looking at things that we could do to make it better and eventually decided that I wanted to be one of the people that helped to do that. Yeah, when I was young, we, we used our hands and our imagination to essentially make the things that we needed. Hi, my name is Katie. I'm 10 and I live in Saskatoon. I'm a sci-fi kid and I've been in sci-fi for three years. What's different about sci-fi from school is that you get to do a lot more hands-on things. I've taken space, science, health. I've taken a bunch of the science ones um, and a lot of engineering. Last year I was lucky in that I won the Trap Memorial Scholarship as well as the Kilbourne Engineering Scholarship. This year I received the John Deere Scholarship. Those scholarships are, are really big as a student because, you know, paying for university myself, it really goes a long way in, in taking some of the stress out of life. Leadership is important to me. Uh, I, try, I try to better myself through leadership. I'm the current captain of the University of Saskatchewan quarter scale tractor design team and basically what that competition involves is the students designing and building a tractor from the ground up. Our A team placed fourth place out of the 24 and our X team placed third place out of 11, so two top five finishes for us. The focus of the college in expanding student learning spaces really speaks to the, the importance of the design teams and the experience that we gain as students through these, through these design teams. With the support of the university, our designs are becoming more and more complex. I chose the University of Saskatchewan because of how it's, it's known to the rest of Canada and, and internationally as, as a place where things are happening. I hope I'm going to be able to come to this university one day, it's really fun. Saskatchewan as a whole is, is growing and our, our economy is booming and we've got all these opportunities that are available to us. For example, the Canadian Light Source is an internationally renowned research facility and that's established and growing right here at the University of Saskatchewan. When you think of the word engineer and you think of what an engineer does, the simplest definition to me is, is a problem solver. Creative thinking plays a large part in what we do because essentially you're starting with a blank canvas and, and there's a problem and it needs a solution. The results of engineers work can, can be seen all around us every day. In, in our roads, our, our bridges, our buildings. I think that engineers are important in the world because without them, we wouldn't really have computers, cameras, and TVs, and we wouldn't have any electronics, and so we couldn't do that much. We might not even have a light bulb. The opportunities available to engineers are, are really ever-expanding. Engineering is becoming a bigger part of, of everything we do.